Four season, four seasons in one day. Interesting. It happened. It really did. <laughs> that's how it, that's how it is out here in Louisville. <laughs> so where are you from? New York. New York. Okay. Yeah. That's gotcha. Just came from New York. Mm-hmm. I guess a lot of New Yorkers come out here for a reason. Yeah, there's a big convention going on this weekend. Oh, that's why. That's what draws the crowd. Pretty hot for a moment trying to find you. Pretty hot. I said, uh oh. <laughs> so I saw the time limit. I said, uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> the intersection busy. They don't make any easy way to get to the interstate from the airport. Oh, that sucks. You used to it around here, you see how it goes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, severe weather tonight, yay. Severe weather tonight? So, yeah. Oh, man. Well, this is the Midwest, well, Southeast, you know, it's a typical for the time of the year. Yeah, yeah. It's springtime, so this is, this is the peak season for severe weather to pop up. Yeah. It's muggy out too, muggy. Oh, you ain't seen Muggy yet. Ha! <laughs> this is comfortable here. I believe you in that one. Whew. Yeah, in the summertime, we have the heat of the day at about 90, 95. You throw in the humidity and mugginess of it. It ramps up to feel like it's about 105. Ay, ay, ay. That must be an eastern seaboard situation right there. It's, all over all over the east is humid in summertime. Well, see, the Ohio Valley, which is what this area is considered, mm -hmm. is like the worst for humidity and allergies. <sighs> for the mosquitoes could imagine that they love it. Yeah, they, they get kind of bad at times. Ugh. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah. The Ohio Valley is a long stream of it, long of it. A couple of states run through it. Yeah. But I, uh, I'm used to it, so it, it don't affect me, man. Mm-hmm. Drink a lot of water. Wear light clothes. You'll be fine. So where'd you say you're going to go eat? That, that, that orange spot? Yeah, orange clover. Hmm. Yeah, test it out one day and get a chance. Yeah, severe weather is coming. You see the sky is already blue, dark. Yeah, we got a storm rolling in. Whew. Yeah, the plane had a tough time, a lot of turbulence. Oh really? It's supposed to flew over it. <laughs> yeah, turbulence is wild around this region. It's a nice day today, can't complain. Oh no, it's really nice. A lot better than it was yesterday. Whew. It was rainy all day. Well, that sucks. I work outside, so oh. it's even worse. Ay, ay, ay. No there's no escape with that one. Nope. So you work this and the other job, keep yourself busy, that's good. Yeah, I do. Full time, I work uh, in lawn care. Mm -hmm. And I do DoorDash, Uber, Lyft. It's just a good thing. Yeah. And then on top of that, I'm trying to take off with my content creation. So that's another full time job in itself. Yeah, that's how it is in life. We all got to do it. You know, Just keep the money coming in. Nobody can't make it for us. We gotta make it for ourselves. That's right. Bills don't pay themselves. <laughs> you got that right. Nice they did though. Yes, it did. Pretty warm out here. The leaves is growing quick. 
Yeah, it all just like the dogwoods here, they just started to bloom in the last two or three days. Yeah, a lot of warm 60s, 70s coming in quick. That's the best part of the year. See all the leaves bloom, different colors. Mm hmm. So special event is happening out here, so pretty people are ready for it. Uh, we got Derby coming up in uh, about a month and a half. Oh, Kentucky Derby, always hear about that TV. Yeah. Actually, we're not far from Churchill Downs itself, really. Mm, it's interesting. Five minutes down the road over here. Mm-hmm. Yeah, two weeks leading up to Derby. It's busy around here. Whew. We got what's called Thunder Over Louisville, which is uh, starts off as like an air show. Well, that's nice. And then at night, kind of firework show big. It's actually the biggest firework show in the U.S., I believe. I could believe that one. Whew. And then they do like a, a steamboat race down on the river, parades, all kinds of special things. It's very nice. Yeah. Nice little build up for two minutes for a derby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's always a sellout crowd for that event, too. Oh, yeah. Even though I've lived here all my life, I've never actually been to the derby. Whoa. Into you know what it is? Because you know it's right there, so you know you can go anytime you want. You yeah, know? and it's just the crowd is so crazy. Whew. It's like it's that sport is very intense. Oh yeah. And that sky looks dangerous. See the sky? Oof. Oh yeah. Probably tornadoes. <laughs> Am I trying to pop up? Lightning, thunderstorm. Actually, I was uh, doing Uber last Friday night, and I had just pulled up there to the airport, and I got a warning for a tornado warning on my phone. Ooh. Oh, I look at it. I think you're like, oh man, you got to work up in that. Tuesday. Like, damn. Yeah, I asked Lee. I said, well, I said we can either go find shelter or we can keep going. <laughs> <laughs> home, I said, okay. <laughs> yeah, the sirens were going off like crazy all over town. Oh. You go through this every year. Oh yeah, and it's gotten to the point now that even in the winter, it's, it gets bad at times. Whoa, t tornadoes pop up there in the winter too? Yeah, uh, just probably an hour, hour and a half south of here on December 10th, the whole town was destroyed by a tornado. Oh, I think I remember seeing it on the new, on the weather channel. I was like, wow, in the winter time it happens this? Jeez. Yeah, it was, a, it was a big ordeal. Oh, yeah, yeah. As we see, tornadoes got in any season now. Like people say, maybe global warming or, you know, climate change. Kentucky's such a very long state. Yeah. In New Orleans had a powerful tornado the other day. They did, didn't they? Yes, they did. Uh, they, bar they barely get that out there, so I don't understand that. <laughs> it's just one of those fluke incidents. <laughs> so you in town very long? Well, uh, a couple of days, that's it. Okay. Hang, around these, hang around here, see how it's like, something to do. Rush hour? <laughs> oh. uh, yeah, lunch hour, so... Oh, everybody want that lunch. <laughs> the last time I passed through, the, I passed through this region was on Amtrak. It was an overnight train. Yeah. Yeah, I passed through around all of this. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. Amtrak is pretty much a fun ride, smooth. My grandpa did it years ago, and he really highly recommended it, so... You got time, you know, there's no hurry, you know. You'll like it. It's comfortable.
You been to New York before? No, I sure haven't. Woo! I want to. I've got family that lives there, but. Yeah, you go there one day. You'll like it. <laughs> it's a nice vacation for you to explore. My parents have been a few times. Never offered to take me. One of the largest city in the, in the country. I'm sure it's a nice sight to see. Yeah, a lot to see, definitely. How's the winter out here? A lot of snow? Not really. Uh, cold, but not much snow, really. Mm. You might see. It's not that bad. Mm. Our snows are usually two to three inches at a time. <laughs> hmm. Downtown Louisville look pretty quiet out here. Yeah. Not much going on. <laughs> Come the weekend, it's a different deal. <sighs> ay, ay, ay. Yeah, weekends, people always come out on the weekends anywhere. Yeah, it, you look, it looks bad to the west of us. It's gonna throw down sometime today. Oh, yeah, it's gonna be here very soon. Uh oh. Uh, next 20, 30 minutes of being here. Woo! You gotta work in that too. It's like, oh, good luck. <laughs> yeah. You gotta take shelter at once, if anything. Ohio River, it's a pretty famous river. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, back to the state of Indiana. It's amazing how they both connect both states. Mm -hmm. Indiana. Cincinnati, Ohio is like one of the major cities around this region. Yep. It's like one two hour drive from here. Uh, it's about, yeah, Cincinnati is roughly two hours mm -hmm. where my dad lives. Yeah, I, like, I like Ohio. I went to Cedar Point, a lot of roller coasters. That's a fun park to go to. That park, whew. That's like about my best fun park in history. Oh, this guy looks dangerous. Wow. Scary. So New York, we're not, I'm not used to seeing those clouds like that in New York. No. <laughs> yeah, New York barely gets severe weather, barely. Is that because it's right by the water, by the ocean? Place again? It's, our, it's called Orange Clover. Right here. Mm -hmm. You gotta eat there one day. I've never even known it's there. <laughs> it's like in, it's like in the middle. If you, it's like when you pass right by it. What a town square. Nice many more for for Jefferson. Yeah. Well, at least you know where this place is at. So one day yeah. on your lunch break. This